In this video, we'll look at the Preferences menu and how to import and export those preferences. This is useful if you work on multiple computers and want to keep the preferences consistent between them. Go to Window, Preferences, and here they all are. The first one is Accessibility. You can change the colors of the axes if you want. This is useful for those who are colorblind. In the Applications menu, you can map a digital imaging program to SketchUp. For example, if you have Photoshop or EarthenView, you need to drill down to the EXE file and then just click Open, and that way when you open an image, it will open in that digital imaging program, and it will update in SketchUp when you're done changing it. Here are compatibility options, drawing options if you want your mouse to work by click drag release or auto detect or click move click, or you want it to not continuously line draw, and you have all those options. In the Files menu, you can specify where you want SketchUp to look for all these different files. Here are general preferences. You can tell SketchUp how often to autosave, for instance to automatically fix problems when they're found. And if you like SketchUp checking for updates, then keep this clicked. OpenGL options. Here's the shortcuts menu. You can find out what the shortcut is for existing tools or add one if the tool doesn't have a shortcut. Choose a template here and then some options for the workspace. Going back to the Files menu, this is where you import and export your preferences. Click Export, and then a DAT file will appear. Export it. If you're on a different computer, or you need to re-import those preferences on the same computer, click Import. Find that DAT file and bring it in.